Alright, so I took this thing apart once already today, and I'm going to be taking it apart again, and you'll probably hear why in just a second. Hear that bearing noise? That's because I got water in the front bearing, so now I have to take this thing apart again and oil it. This is going to be fun. Alright, I got the nut off the blower wheel, and it's free. Um... That nut is reverse thread. It was pretty loose, actually. Um, so I'm trying to take this piece of styrofoam out. There was a screw in it. Like, right, right up there where you can see where that hole is. Right up there. And there's still some shit on there that needs to be cleaned off. So I'm going to do that while I have it out. This is a pain in the ass. You can see I actually broke part of the styrofoam. I have the piece right here, so I'll just glue it, you know, glue it on. But, um, I didn't break it trying to pull this blower wheel out. I just broke it trying to pull the piece of styrofoam out because I didn't see there was a screw over there. And even though I got all the screws out, it's still been a pain in the ass to get out. So, I love these air conditioners, but they are such a pain in the ass to work on. I finally got the nasty thing out. As you can see, it still needs to be cleaned a lot. Really glad that that happened. Got the blower wheel out, now I can at least put some oil in there and get that motor quieted down a little bit. Okay, so I got the oil in there. Let's see if it's any quieter. Eh, it's a little better. At least there's lubricant in there now. I'm happy about that. So, yeah. Now I'm gonna go take this filthy thing upstairs, wash it, and uh, tomorrow I'll get some super glue and fix the stupid parts that I broke. Okay, so I cleaned this thing off with a sponge and some soap and water. This is the next day. And I got the blower wheel back on. I took the uh, evaporator off as far as it would go. So I'm about to put that piece of foam that's all broken back in. Um, I'm not having a good day so far. Because I broke that shit last night. And I was trying to clean out the motor on this uh, 50s GE box fan. And I dropped the motor and broke a winding. So now that motor is uh, for donor parts only. Which I guess is kind of convenient since I needed a... Uh, a uh, belt washer for this one anyway, so I'll just take the one from that uh, and put it in here, I guess. That way I don't have to buy a new one. But yeah, this is uh, pretty clean inside at this point. It shouldn't smell at all. So I'm just working on putting this back in, and I'm going to use some Gorilla Glue to hold the broken piece of foam on, or the broken pieces, rather. I broke a couple pieces off. It's all put back together now. Um, so let's go ahead and start it up again. I had it running for a little bit and the compressor actually started, but let's turn it back on. Unfortunately, the glue did not work, so I just put it back together and put the pieces in there. And uh, I'm hoping that the uh, you know pressure that they're under will hold them in place. So it is what it is, but I'm glad it's back together and I was able to oil the bearing.